Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make the best and thickest instant pot vanilla yogurt. I hope you enjoy this video and without further ado, let's get right into the video. We're first going to start off by measuring how many cups or bowls we want full of yogurt. I used nine cups of milk because I had nine cups and I wanted to fill all of them with yogurt. And what I really like about this recipe so that it's adjustable to your preference, you can easily half this recipe or double this recipe. Okay, so I'm just going to continue pouring in my nine cups of milk. After we have our milk, I'm just going to get some actual vanilla yogurt. I'm just going to put in four tablespoons and a half, and I'm just going to whisk all of that up until everything is completely combined. Next, I'm going to be adding vanilla sugar. You don't have to use this, but let me tell you one thing. I really recommend it because it really gives it that vanilla flavor and it bursts the flavor okay moving on we're going to get some milk powder i'm going to be using about four scoops of milk powder Okay, now we're going to whisk all of that up until everything is completely combined. Make sure everything is completely combined. And I'm just going to throw in another half of the milk powder scoop. I'm gonna continue mixing until everything is fully combined. Now I'm going to start adding some brown sugar you're going to need about one tablespoon of brown sugar, or you can just use plain white sugar, but brown sugar really gives it that flavor. You can add brown sugar, like you can add up to two tablespoons. So I'm just going to mix that up and I'm going to set it on low heat while I'm mixing it up on top of my stove. And now your yogurt mixture is literally done. You're just going to fill up your little cups or bowls with the milk yogurt mixture. Now you're going to set your Instant Pot to the yogurt setting and you're going to add your cups into there. And the cups should be inside the uh, Instant Pot bowl. You're going to set that in the Instant Pot for eight hours or overnight. Then you're going to set it into your fridge until it's solid or like a yogurt consistency. And here's your final result, result a very thick and creamy yogurt. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you for watching.